as you probably already read, this one was inspired, this gift or table, if you will, was inspired by the reef. So if any of you have been to the reef at Wainimi, you know they have these little tables there that everybody can drink at. And they have a little rope in there and all that good stuff. But I want to do something different for this chief. And again, I use the chief term as in chief, senior chief, or master chief because, again, I want you to guess whose this is. If you've been following me, you probably already know. But again, this is basically timber lumber that's three inches thick that I did use the CNC for and I cut out where I'm going to put rope in there and the centerpiece is where this chief wanted to put the three anchors of senior chief or chief, senior chief, and master chief. The first time I did it, I didn't put them like he wanted to, so this one here will show um, how he wanted them placed in the table itself. So let's get started. So as you can see there is a set of two of them. So once I've cut them and had them ready, I then stained them and then placed the anchors in an area that I wanted to make sure was aesthetically pleasing. And once I did that, I was able to go on to the next step. Again, re-verifying where they need to be placed, placing them by actually gluing them and actually putting a little uh, drill hole for the anchors to set in. Then I placed the epoxy over just that area itself because I want to make sure I don't have to worry about bubbles anywhere else. And if you know about epoxy and if you don't do a first layer thinly of epoxy, you're going to have a lot of bubbles. So I did my thin layer and then I placed it in there. Once I was done with that, I soaked the rope in epoxy and then and placed it too. By doing that, I was able to take out or have less of an issue of bubbles in the future for this. So once I had everything done, I put on my four layers. This was the final result. But now these tables here that you see actually can go at the, the lower level for a chair and I got these stamps from Amazon so it has a little hook on the bottom of it that you lift it up it goes to a bistro size so you can have a bistro chair next to it too but again that's all depending upon you now depending on what you want to do you don't have to just do three anchors it could be for a first class it could be for an officer but this is a great set for retirement gifts I will give you a hint this chief came down and spoke at um, one of the pinnings here uh, at Point Magoo but again, thank you for watching. Again, this is just another gift idea for you. You can add, subtract, or do whatever you want. I just want to give you more ideas for our bro fellow brothers and sisters out there when they retire to make sure they're taken care of. And again, thank you for watching.